Mr. Foster was my childhood boss. Mr. Foster is probably one of the reasons why I'm in here now. Well, he is the reason. Yeah, because when I was a kid, I, I looked up to him coming in here. And um, just so happened one day we ended up working together. It was the best thing that ever happened to me. Because I needed Did you grow up in the neighborhood? It's kind of hard for him to say. Mr. Foster was almost Emotional. like an, a, a father figure yeah. for, like I explained to Coach Dungeon, that a lot of us didn't have. A lot of us, me and Ben, grew up without our fathers. So yeah. looking for a male role model is very important for men of color that do not have that connection in life. So when you see someone that you want to emulate, they become very powerful point in your life, and that's what Mr. Foster was to him. What was it? What was it about? What made him so? It's strong? just his the way he was, the way he explained things, the way he the way he he came down to our level as as, as men, told you sure. grown men, yes. and told us how it yes. is, how it is going to be. And sure enough, you walk out that shop, and it was the way exactly the way he would explain. How, how old were you when you guys started coming in? Uh, we was about ten years ago, probably in our Early 30s. Was, yeah. We've been coming into this shop. This, this, this shop has been here since the 80s. That skip was hat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Foster used to wear that. Okay, and, I and, think and he had the first 1976 right, with a tie in the back car. Foster, 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 Fo